Mr. Burns said that we should um, burn or throw away these kids. In this case, he mentioned uh, minorities because they didn't get their high school diploma. They dropped out. We might as well burn them, you know, throw them away. Well, now it's my turn. There's my race card. I'm throwing it in. I'm not a minority, except in maybe Southern California because I'm not Hispanic. But um, I do belong to the human race. So there's my race card right there. The bottom line is if you don't have an education, you're not going to succeed. The best you can hope to expect in most cases is to live paycheck to paycheck. Um, being white, it's perceived that I have more benefits or opportunities than somebody that's a minority. Uh, it depends on what you're going after, doesn't it? I guarantee you there's a lot more opportunities for minorities than the middle class white person in a lot of situations. But that's, that's irrelevant. I don't care about that. You know, more power to you if there's something you can use to get ahead in life and it's not hurting others, knock yourself out. Um, to condemn the man because of his comments, well, that's pretty short uh, short-sighted. You've got two camps. NAACP, you know, they, they defend the rights of everybody, predominantly colored people. I mean, it's in their, it's in their name for crying out loud. That's just the way it is. Um, they perceive this to be a slant against minorities. Uh, he could have maybe said everybody. At this point, he was directly referencing minorities. The 40% is probably a true number in that demographic. So what? The truth hurts. The only reason the NAACP is mad is because it's coming from a successful white man and not a black person or a person of color or a minority of any kind. Uh, in YouTube you had a guy, sounds like a great plan, let's implement that, which could be misquoted from me right now. That's the other extreme of this. You got people that are stupid that want to do stuff like that too. So it goes both ways, left and right. Bottom line is, if you don't get a diploma, you're screwed. And that's basically what he was saying. So, you know, quit with the race card. It's life.